Raise your hand if you knew this would happen. It's happened again. It's happened again. Yeah, this result was more obvious than that. Liverpool 5 0 versus United like a year or two ago. This was supposed to be a mouth watering hate watch, but you just gotta feel for Arsenal, man. Imagine the fate of your title rests on the hands of Spurs. You know, the guys who just lost like four matches on the spin yeah. and got rinsed by every top six clubs in a month, and especially got soundly beat by a Chelsea of all teams. Each time when I come here, I am abused. I'm gone. I've liked it. I've liked it. I've liked it. Um, it's the history of the Tottenham. I watched the match like everyone else and I wasn't buying it when Spurs were holding off and frustrating City in the first half. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You can't fool me, Pasta Coglu. I know what I saw out there. Your men in the first half were looking like a bunch of scared puppies playing it safe and all that. I can't believe that not only Holland but also Doku did a madness last night. But but Holland was supposed to be a ghost in big games. I'm I'm literally already applying to my local McDonald's because Holland will put me out of putting me out of a YouTube job if he actually starts performing in big games. Fucking hell man. I'm finished. Oddly enough, a 7 Ortega save has the same vibes as the Martinez World Cup final save. And y'all y'all can't tell me it's not true. I love and appreciate you, Sony, but bro, you gotta do way better than that, man. You're you're the Asian Ronaldo for a reason. You He was in your boot, he got in your head! When you really think about it, Mujic earning Chelsea a draw is a reason Arsenal won't win the league this season. Anyways, we all know the title's done. There's no there's no way a struggling West Ham is beating a City team on top of the world at home. I'm betting my entire life savings, my parents' fortune, and my entire channel on it.